Hey guys, I'm Andy Jones, or James, whatever you want to call me, and I got this game off the hum humble bundle thingy. I don't know. I, I just recently discovered the humble. It hasn't been too long, but uh, yeah, this game it's one of those indie games that they were giving out. Not sure what it's gonna be like. I know it's an indie platform from the description I read. Program was a failure. People forgot this. It was a massive flop. The coder started adding name strings to owls as a joke. Thomas at twenty blah blah blah. Whatever. Thomas was alive. Oh my God. It's fully voice. First thought to have. Wow, I'm a block. This is pretty. This is pretty sweet. I'm Balaki. It says uh, moving keys. Left thumbstick, blah blah blah. I guess this is for console too. If you have a, or you have a controller, move, escape, start button. Okay, I think that's pretty simple. We just go to that. I guess there's some kind of story going on here. Move me keys. I got this. I got this. Thomas decided to start listing his observations for posterity. For posterity. Uh, One. The whole alone thing. Two, portals. They led somewhere. He's yet to work out where. The storyline. Three, falling. Thomas was absolutely fantastic at falling. He was almost as good at falling as he was at observing. The first indie game I've played where I don't have to read and show off my horrible reading skills because they do all the talking for us. Plus, I like the guy's accent. Oh, yeah. We go in there. Movement keys. Okay, interesting. Thomas couldn't fall past this block. I think, damn it, I think. What if there was some kind of hmm. inverted fall? Some way to. What's the word? Jump. Jump over a block? That'd be pretty cool. It worked. Thomas had solved the great inverted fall mystery. Okay, I have no idea what went on right there, but I solved some kind of mystery. Because I am the Thomas. This little point four, I guess these are the levels. But Thomas noted there was no real danger in missing it. The world didn't want him to fail here. It was pushing him, but gently. Oh, that was a big jump. I could make that. I kind of gave up on it too early. Let's do this. I'm playing with my left hand, by the way. I'm right-handed. This is not very good. I don't have much control as I would like. This all seemed a little dangerous. Oh, Thomas. Whoa, 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 keeps falling, keeps falling, keeps falling. Oh, I wanted to breathe that, but the ground was falling behind me. Thomas wondered whether the portals were actually taking him anywhere. He felt like he was making progress, but I don't feel like I'm making progress, really. He seemed to be moving predominantly up and to the right, which might or might not be important. Because we're going the right way because we're right types of people. This really is like, this game puts the platform in platformer. There's so many platforms to jump on. It might have been paranoia again, but Thomas could have sworn the world was becoming more complicated. It always seemed to be one step ahead of his skills. It kind of is coming complicated. Designed just for him. He wondered why. Was the world testing him? No. It was obvious. Yes, this game has all kinds of like psychology in it. I think I'm doing pretty good with my left hand, even though I'm not left handed. I'm kind of just running through this right now. Um. Something about the boiling glowing water intimidated Thomas he didn't like it oh he certainly didn't want to swim in it yes he made another mental note what is that or water not good to be avoided Thomas is a smart guy he's making all these mental notes I it's kind of hard to do commentary when you have a, a commentator commenting the story I've noticed instead of me reading all the time was getting to Thomas no amount of observation or obsessive note taking could combat that. Go up. Go, Thomas, go. No. 
No, Thomas, no. Okay, I have no idea. Okay, we're gonna go over here, Thomas. Oh yeah, platforming at Spitfires. No, I didn't mean to do that. Come on, Tom. Come on, Tom. It's funny because I got a guy that works at my job and his name is Thomas. And he's kind of a spaz. I wish he was more like this cube I'm playing with. No, I'm a, I don't want to play with Thomas in that that sort of way. But if he was a cube, like a square, he'd be a lot more fun to play with. Or hang out with, chill, whatever you do when you're grown. No homo, once again. Thomas had a new theory. What is the theory, Thomas? Look at the text. The text even he could feel moves in. Smarter. There was the mental list to consider. Over the minutes and seconds since his spontaneous generation, he'd become a pretty skilled jumper. Oh, Thomas is a skilled jumper, huh? He just wished he had someone to share it with. Oh, you're sharing it with me, though, Thomas. We're having fun doing these jumps. This game is very relaxing. I need to play this more when I get stressed. This level is kicking my butt, though. I don't know. I gotta get up here. Like, I'm actually having really fun. Just bloop, 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 bloop. This is pretty fun. Come on, Thomas. Let's go. Oh, yeah. The level design is actually really nice looking too. That's the crazy part about this. Yeah, we made it. We got 10. Be there or be square, I guess. I submitted hundreds of bug reports. I told the idiot this would happen. Overlapping scripts. More than one AI was bound to be spawned into environment at the sen at some point. Turns out, but I didn't get to read all of it. Chris took an immediate and deep dislike to the skinny red rectangle. Who the hell did this Thomas think he was? Oh god, so we got two of these now, so it's two Thomases. Um, I'd like to thank you guys for joining us. I think I'm gonna end this here. We're gonna figure out who Chris is. He's a square, but um we're gonna figure out who Chris is. And that's gonna be next episode. I'm Indy Jones, or you can call me James. Sorry about these guys to be short. This game is probably really, really short. So I'm going to try to break it up as many episodes as I can without being a douchebag about it. I'm not not trying to like fluff my videos or anything, but I, I kind of want to make this a, a little series. just like a little casual series. That's what I'm planning to do. But anyway, I'm rambling on. Thanks for watching. I'm Indy Jones. You should like, comment, and subscribe. And 